What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I bring you another Destiny 2 video and today I want to talk about the recent TWAB and the issues many people are talking about in regards to trials and if it will ever make a return. But before we go any further guys, if you do enjoy the video and appreciate my honesty, do go ahead and smash that like button. So the TWAB talks about Crimson Poop and Iron Banner returning next week. That's mostly it besides a few fixes coming with a patch just before the Joker's Wild arrives, which I believe is early March. But other than that people, the main focus of the TWAB is Trials. Here's what Bungie said. Ever since Trials and I went on hiatus back in Season 4, many of you have been asking when it will come back and how it will be evolving. We still don't have a timeline for when it may return, but we do want to give you an update on our current thinking about Trials. Here is the team to fill you in, quoting the Destiny dev team. As long time Destiny players know, Trials of Osiris was released in May of 2015 and was the original high stakes weekend PvP event. Trials had an amazing impact on our game and our community. It was a pinnacle venue for players to show off their best skills, strategies and gear. The 3v3 elimination mode combined with the card system created the converted reward of earning a trip to the lighthouse. With the induction of Trials of Nine and Destiny 2, we made a few changes to the formula which never really hit the same mark. We were unhappy with its role in the ecosystem. The new activity wasn't achieving the goal of bringing the community together every weekend. Both Destiny and the online PvP scene has evolved since 2015, so we don't believe that bringing back the 2015 version of Trials of Osiris would accomplish what our goals are today. Until we have a solid prototype, for a pinnacle PvP end game activity, Trolls is staying on hiatus indefinitely and will not return over the course of the next few seasons. When we have those new plans ready, we'll be sure to share them with you. Now most of you guys don't follow me on Twitter, which is linked within the video description, go follow me. So you won't have seen my initial thoughts on this matter. The thing is, I appreciate they are being honest about the situation, but in my opinion, them not working on Trials and making it a main priority is an utter joke. Okay, so Trials in Destiny 1 I wasn't even a massive fan of, but it brought so much more to the game in terms of bringing people together. Whether it was through playing together and grinding to get to that lighthouse and get that beautiful lighthouse loot, or even chilling in your favourite PvP player stream and having a chat with fellow Guardians. Destiny 2's Trials of 9 in my opinion arrived when PvP was in a terrible state. PvP fixed itself up via Bungie applying some of the best changes we've seen to the franchise and actually making PvP fun to play, for the most part. But they took Trials away before doing this and most people, they thought they were going to improve it and bring it back, maybe make it a 3v3 again and bring it back revolutionised. But nope, even with the outcry for its return, it seems as though Bungie ain't interested in delivering what people want and it is a true shame. They should be on this hardcore 24-7, everybody wants it back. It's just crazy to think that we won't get it till at least September, which is just nuts, people. And what's happening at the moment is many of game developers out there are dropping new ways, fun ways, for us to play together. While it seems Bungie are stuck in some kind of cloudy bubble, not really fussed about the content they put out. Crimson Days is not a joke now, Iron Banner is Iron Banner. And I have a feeling Joker's World will be so Gambit based, which most people don't really enjoy nowadays, it will probably fail miserably, which I don't want to see happen, but I just have that feeling. So with Trials not coming until at least September, like I said, I don't know how Destiny is going to survive. I just don't feel there's much there anymore. Now I know things are going down with Activision and Bungie, and I'm certain it's affecting and will continue to affect the game for many more moments. I just hope that when Activision is out of the picture altogether, we get what we all want, and that is a proper Destiny game. Now I say this from the bottom of my heart, Destiny is or was everything for me and my channel. Seeing it in such a sad state isn't something I enjoy, even though in the past I have hated on the game and the choices Bungie have made, but it comes out of love for the franchise. But with so many other games coming like Anthem, Apex being here and taking the world by storm, I honestly feel Bungie are sitting there thinking there's no point in dropping anything big while other big names are dropping which will no doubt take from our community and affect our pockets which is true to a degree, but they should be in competition with these said games. 
they shouldn't be allowing these other game developers to swallow up their own community because what it does is it does nothing but lead people away making it harder and harder for them to get the original fan base back so the less content they pull out while these new games are coming and new games people are hyped for the more they push these people towards these new games which ultimately makes it harder for them to initiate a new relationship with these said people because once a lot of people move on they won't come back I mean yes Destiny's got its hardcore fan base which will probably never go anywhere but it isn't just about a hardcore fan base. Bungie should be in competition with these new games. There's no two which ways about it. I just truly hope something sparks very soon for the game. If it isn't within the Joker's world, then something sooner rather than later has to be done. Also people, what the heck happened to Faction Rallies? Have Bungie just completely forgot about this thing? Yep, I have no idea either. But that's a whole new story for a whole new video. But on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. This is just my personal opinion and us not getting trials and nine back. Let me know your opinion on this down below within that comment section. Also guys, I do apologise about my voice. I am flued up and it's absolutely killing me. But hey, on that note, we've come to the end. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, really does help out. And hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.